everybody. I'm BB Penguin 9 and he's EJ. And today we're going to show you how to record your computer screen. Let's get into it. The program we're going to use for this video is called Open Broadcaster Software. First, you'll need to go to the website and download it. Link will be in the description. Once it is installed, we can start using it. Now, as you guessed, screen recording is not the primary function of this program. In fact, we could have a number of episodes of showing what this software can do. But for now, let's keep it on track. First, click on the settings in the top right. Here's what we have set for encoding. Copy it if you would like. Be sure to click apply once you are done. Next, go to broadcast settings and make sure mode is set to file output only. One more important thing on this page is to set where you want your recording to go and what file type you want. I have it set to save the file type as mp4, since this is the most universal file type and it works well for us. Once again, click apply. Moving on, click on video. Here you set the resolution. It will vary on what size of screen you are using, but I would go with monitor. Next, you can change the number of frames per second, FPS. At first, you will only be able to go to 60, which is fine for us, but we will show you in a bit how to go even higher. Under audio, set desktop audio device to your speakers. Now, if you want to add a microphone, then click microphone audio device and select what mic you want to choose. If you just want the audio from the computer, then select disable. Going to advance, you can see our settings. Copy them if you'd like. If you want more frames in your recording, then check mark the box that says allow 61 to 120 FPS entry in video settings. Then go back to video and make the FPS to as high as you would like it. Now click OK and right click in the box called Sources. Then click on Monitor Capture. Enter whatever name you want and then you can change the settings. We just keep it as is. Once that is done, make sure it is checkmarked in the Sources box and then click Start Recording. You can also click Preview Stream to see it beforehand. Once you're done recording, click Stop Recording and you have completed your screen recording. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you have a question you want answered, you can make a post on our Facebook page, send us a tweet, or shoot us a post on Google+. Links for those will be in the description. And to get notified when new episodes are up, click that and subscribe button. You can also click up here to check out the previous episode where we talked about how to create channel art and custom thumbnails. Also, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and share it. Thanks again for watching. Bye!